I've already uh, done a separate uh, video on gold, but uh, I felt like I missed out a bit on uh, de on details on silver. So this video is about in details for silver analysis, and I believe that we're uh, expecting and we're approaching a very good time for silver um, for buyers. All right. So the chart analysis in front of you, the Elliott wave analysis in front of you. We'll, I'll do just a bit of commentary. It's self-explanatory. Hopefully it'll be a bit uh, helpful for you. So from this bottom, I do believe that we have a five wave structure right over here. Um, we do have a larger uh, bottom that actually is plays over here. So I do believe that we have a five wave structure completing over here. And then we have a messy correction right over here. But I'm not discussing that right now. But from this bottom, it feels like we have a clear five wave structure, which is wave one and two. Uh, right over here and three and four and wave five structure right now we basically correcting the whole previous structure uh, we are very close to the completion of it uh, but still in terms of uh, i guess that we're going to see a bit of more move on the downside uh, and that will uh, bring us to the lower section of the wave four of the previous five wave structure uh, so next uh, i would say about uh, a uh, week we can have time we should give enough time for silver to reach the bottom and that bottom is important somewhere around 26 dollar and 15 cents and the reason is important because this is going to be a major bottom um that if you want to buy it uh, then it will be it will st it'll be standing up we are not, not expecting the prices of silver to come at this bottom once again if when this happens and because as soon as this occurs, we are expecting a sharper move on the upside uh, right over here, finding a resistance right over here, and then a, a lower pullback. And after that, we are expecting much larger move um, on the upside toward around 60 ish dollar. So I'm expecting that as soon as this happens, we'll start the larger move. Uh, the initially, the, the move is expected to go from $26 to all the way to $32.50, and then some p correction. And, and then we are expecting a larger larger move towards 60 ish dollar in a small amount of time uh, i would say about three months so a lot is expected in in silver but i believe the next week and a half is very interesting when it comes to correction i'll do the a bit of commentary on the labeling i believe that this uh, is wxy pattern that we are going through right now I believe that we have completed a W right over here, which is a, a zigzag pattern. Okay, and then we have an A, B, and C, a flat correction right over here, and then we have a clear five wave structure. Uh, this is X basically. So we have a W completed, a zigzag pattern, and a flat correction as X, and then we are actually going through an A, B, C structure. You can clearly count a five wave structure to the bottom, a very messy correction, and the top is already being formed. I'm expecting another five wave correction on the downside. Uh, five way move on the downside which should be matching this swing so you can clearly see this move crack swing and then move down so we're expecting an a b and c structure to be finishing somewhere on the bottom of it so i'm bearish for next uh, seven eight days i would say um uh, and let's see maybe it can take about five six days instead of seven eight ten or ten days so we're looking for the completion of the structure we can do we can label this if you are not uh, seeing it properly. We can start from one over here. We one, two, uh, three, four, and five. Okay, I'll delete it in order to avoid any mess. What I'm going to do one more thing is draw the channel, and this channel is going to be uh, very interesting uh, when it comes to finding the price target, and that's right over here. It should provide us with some um, guidance we have also horizontal support right over here and then i'll draw another tool as well to help you out with the, the uh, so this is we're expecting around 26 dollar two cents which is low for the previous low for the previous wave right over here but in addition to it just in case you don't want to miss that in case the previous range is extremely important which is um, basically starting from this bottom Oh, sorry this bottom all the way to the top which is a five wave structure so what we can do is can simply draw nine equal divisions here we have eight equal divisions silver has a habit of following nine equal divisions so i'm going to use, use that but either of them work but most often silver follows uh, nine equal divisions from time to time it does eight equal division too so if you bring nine equal division from the top that will be five waves five out of nine so we have one two three four and five and you can find the support right over here too right at the four by nine so i'm expecting that we are yet not done with the correction and then your price is expected to come low and the, our target is somewhere around 25.92 all right and then 
won't be expecting the prices to go up as soon as prices come down and jump up above the channel that will be our indication that we have found a bottom and this is going to be a very important bottom you might want to buy um, some bullion if you're interested in buying and holding the bullion then this is place going to be so it's going to be very interesting for a long-term wave analysis uh, we will talk about a bit of larger wave structure that you are looking at it and it may be confusing you a bit so we can come and do a weekly wave right over here okay and I don't want to bring this too much of a stuff it's too much let's uh, come to daily stuff okay yeah here's a bit clear so we have a clear structure from over here which is move structure upward and a correction the correction is basically very messy and that's what I'm considering right now A, B, C, and so when the price comes down our um, false would be right over here the entry of the wave in the previous structure would be right over here that point which is 2441 I don't believe that's going to go enter into that territory so this is the larger wave one and a correction followed which is wave two we have another this wave which is complete already wave three and wave four and now you know why I'm saying this structure is going to be very important silver has a habit of making the fifth wave the longest and the strongest so that will be completing the larger five wave structure once that is complete uh, we are going to get so once this is over we are expecting for the structure to complete a five wave structure all right so this is what i'm expecting uh, in, in the long long term from the bottom right over here and once that is complete you're expecting good pattern and that's why you can see that we are expecting a time consuming flat cut action which will be sitting on the top of the previous tops that we have so i hope that i was of some assistance uh, for some of you guys who uh, follow urdu language you can actually i have started in urdu language um, it's a bit hard to post on both on one but you might want to just subscribe the channel name is kafat okay kafat i'll write it over here so if you are interested in uh, in following me on my Urdu channel uh, and then the channel name is ah let me see what the hell is happening I figured out there it is so that's the channel name okay that's my Urdu channel name if you want to follow you can just click on it um, in, in YouTube search and it will show you so hopefully I was of some assistance help you some uh, see some structure in the market which you look good luck with your trading have a good one and bye bye